Are you looking for a place to live in Northern Virginia that's close to DC, has cool places to eat and shop, and has a great nightlife scene? Then stay tuned because today we're in Arlington, Virginia, and I wanna show you what it's like to live right here. In 2019, Arlington was named one of the best cities in America to live. And honestly, it's one of my most favorite places in the Washington metro area. It has fun things to do, it's close to the city, so whether you wanna go downtown to a sporting event or to a museum, it's so easy to get there, whether you take a bike, whether you take a bird, you can Uber, you can Metro, it's really easy. It's located on the orange and silver lines, which come from the western suburbs, but so many locations right here in Arlington, from Clarendon to Ballston Courthouse, it's super easy to jump right on the metro and get anywhere you want. But Arlington itself has a lot of great things to do as well. So whether you're a current resident or you're thinking about moving here, keep watching and I'll show you the rest of the town. So one of the things that I love about Arlington is all of the locally owned restaurants and shops that are still here, even though there's been so much development that's gone on all around here. It really gives Arlington such a small town feel, even though it's such a big urban center right outside of DC. So North Arlington offers a wide variety of housing types too. You'll find a lot of the original Ramblers that existed here and were built way back when. A lot of those that have been torn down and built into much bigger houses, you'll find townhomes. But what dominates the scene in Clarendon especially are a lot of the high-rise condominiums. These were built in the housing boom in the mid-2000s and they definitely dominate the scene here in this area. So people who live here can commute either direction, whether you're commuting into DC or you're commuting west out to Tyson's Corner, you can avoid sitting in your car for hours because the metro is easily accessible. So owning a home in Arlington can be expensive. According to Zillow, right now at the time we're making this video, which is October of 2019, the average median home price in Arlington is about $695,000. Out of the price range for a lot of people, so renting is definitely a popular option here. So now we're in South Arlington, and I'm standing here at Pentagon Row, which is, as you can see, a cluster of shops and restaurants that are really cool. And this area is just adjacent to the big Pentagon City Mall with the Macy's and Nordstrom's and the Costco and a lot of other office buildings. And this whole area is just south of the actual Pentagon. South Arlington has typically been much more affordable than, than North Arlington, but a lot of more recent development has started here in South Arlington and is only going to continue. The area of Crystal City and the northern part of Potomac Yards and the southern or the eastern part of Pentagon City is now what's called National Landing and that's Amazon's new headquarters here in the DC area. That's only going to increase the demand to live close by and I think we're going to start to see a lot more changes in South Arlington. So one of the coolest parts about all of the high rises in Arlington are the rooftops. You can see in this rooftop, you can see the Washington Monument. You can see all kinds of other monuments right in DC. You can see National Airport over there. You can see the planes coming in and out, and you can relax with a nice glass of wine. 